Hey guys, so today I have for you a review of the November Beauty Heroes box. So this came in the mail this past weekend, and I was able to use this thing a couple of times, or these things a couple of times, to let you know what I thought about them, whether or not I think that you should subscribe to this month's box if you aren't already, and just my thoughts on everything as a whole. So the featured product, so featured products, in the November box were actually the Josh Rosebrook Balanced Shampoo and Conditioner. And this is a new hair care duo to the Josh Rosebrook line. The Balanced formula is the newest formula and I, I'm not exactly sure how long it's been out. I think it's pretty recent that it's been available for purchase, but we also got it in our November Beauty Heroes box. And I'm really excited about this because I've been wanting to try Josh Rosebrook for a really long time and I'm, I do have more oily hair so I was worried about using the Nourish, which is their other formula which I believe is more moisturizing. And I do have really fine, thin hair so I've, I've found lately that more moisturizing shampoos and conditioners can really weigh my hair down and make my hair actually look more oily and greasy than it already is. So I was really excited to try these because it's for all hair textures, and I believe all hair types can use this, but it's made for more normal to oily hair types, and I do have oily scalp and really like dried ends from like heat styling and stuff. And then the sidekick that came in the box this month, because every box comes with a full size and a sidekick, these were the full size. The Sidekick is the Firm Hold Hairspray, and I'm not going to talk about this because I haven't used it yet. I don't use hairspray very often because I don't really style my hair. I mainly just blow dry it and straighten it, and then next day I'll braid it. That's pretty much, that's that's my style. That's my hairstyle. Um, so if I ever use this, or when in the future I do use this, I can always do a separate review on this sometime in the future, but I have heard that people say that this is the best hairspray that they've ever tried, and it says it's supposed to keep hair in place all day without feeling sticky or flaky, so I can attest to that. But this was the sidekick that came in the box this month, so I did want to mention it. But the two products that I will be talking about are the Balance Shampoo and Conditioner. And I love that the mask this month was green. Usually it's red, but I think it's cute that it was green this month. <laughs> and apparently, I was thinking about it when I was getting dressed this morning, I'm apparently wearing the exact same outfit I was wearing in the last month's video, only like slightly different like I was wearing a green shirt and red lips in the last video as well <laughs> the last Beauty Heroes video I've just made it different for winter <laughs> I think green and red I always worry about wearing green and red because I think like Christmas colors like I always think people are gonna look at me and like oh she's Christmas but <laughs> anyway so like I said I have been able to try these a couple of times because I do prefer instead of sort of a more unboxing I do prefer to try them a couple of times um, I do prefer to try the Hero product a couple of times before I make a video about it because I would like to sort of give a recommendation if I really like the product and think that you guys should pick it up because the value of the box this month is $75. The monthly price of the box is only $39, but if you use my first time subscriber code for $10 off, the box would actually be $29 instead of $39. So. Either way, you're still getting a really good value because the shampoo on the shampoo and conditioner each on their own run thirty dollars each. So, um, so if you use the first time subscriber discount, you're basically paying one dollar less than what the shampoo is actually worth. So I have been able to try these two times since I got the box. I tried it on Sunday, and today is Tuesday. I did also wash I did also wash my hair again with them this morning. And I have to say, I really, really like the shampoo and conditioner. I prefer to always have a balance or a clarifying or some kind of oily scalp shampoo and conditioner in my shower at all times. And I had actually just run out of everything in my shower the day that these came in the mail, which was like good timing. So a little bit about these products specifically is, these are like an infusion of superfoods for your hair and scalp. Josh Rosebrook's Balancing Duo is crafted of over 30 organic herbs, flowers, and plants that work in perfect synergy to offer optimal purity, volume, and shine. This shampoo and conditioning duo finely tunes all hair types to, up to optimal balance. Organic extracts of aloe, hemp, jojoba, and flaxseed thoroughly cleanse hair while a bouquet of healing nettle, alfalfa, rosehips, burdock, and calendula works synergistically to further fortify and purify. Extracts of ginseng, cayenne, golden seal, and cinnamon invigorate the scalp and promote hair growth. A lightweight combination of coconut shea, 
Olive and meadow foam plant oils meld with herbal extracts of linden, sage, lavender, and peppermint to nourish, tame, and volumize hair. Typically reserved for high-end face care formulas, organic rosehip and rose essential oils infuse both shampoo and conditioner, elevating them to otherworldly status. So there, like... Like, it's, like it says, there are over 30 organic herbs, flowers, and plants. There is, the, so it gives the, the ingredient list for each one. I'm just going to go ahead and name the superpower ingredients again like I did last month since it's what I went over just now was actually the majority of the ingredients that are in here. But the superpowers are alfalfa, burdock, and nettle, which are the clearing, which are the clearing ingredients. Aloe, coconut, and rose oil are the hydrating ingredients. Um, calendula, chamomile are the calming ingredients. And then rosehip seed oil is the anti-aging ingredient. I don't know how you can anti-age your hair, but maybe it helps with, with its health and stuff. But I'm really impressed with the combination of ingredients that are in this and how well it actually works for at least my specific hair type. I have heard one or two people say that they don't think that it's good for their particular hair type, but they might have different hair type than I do. Since my scalp is more oily, I find that I would benefit from this at least more than some people would, maybe someone who's got more who's got more dry hair. So and like I said, I am really impressed with the ingredients that are in the shampoo and conditioner. This is actually really clean, like really, really clean, compared to even some other clean cleaner shampoo and conditioner. My husband has a couple of different shampoos that are in the shower as well. So I was looking at some of the ingredients on those when I was in there this morning and I was noticing that even some of those that are like the more green clean formulas are not as clean as this one is because this one does have a lot of different extracts and oils and things like that. So it's just a very, very clean formula. I can leave the ingredients down below or a link, a link to the product specifically so you can check out the ingredients for yourself. But on to the products themselves and how I feel like they perform. The, the, the shampoo is actually a little bit different. It doesn't lather like traditional shampoos do and I tried one other shampoo that doesn't lather and actually didn't like that so I was afraid that when I first put this in my hair the first time I wasn't going to like it because it didn't lather and um, it wasn't going to get my hair clean feeling. The other one I had to use a lot of product and it still didn't make my hair feel like super clean. This one actually I don't feel is the same. It does lather slightly like it, it's a tiny lather but it's not like you know bubbles everywhere and the way that it tells you to do this is to divide the scalp into four areas top sides back apply a small amount to each area and massage in thoroughly and then leave in for up to three minutes to stimulate follicles and nourish scalp. So I was worried that when it said um leave in for three minutes to stimulate that my hair, because there's like cinnamon and um, cayenne and things like that in here that it might irritate my scalp, but it doesn't. It doesn't irritate my scalp at all. I don't feel it doing anything else other than just sitting on my scalp, but I do feel like when I rinse it out. So after the three minutes or five minutes, I'm not very good at like timing things in the shower, but after I've rinsed it out, my hair feels clean. It actually even feels kind of soft. Like some shampoos I use, my hair will feel like straw-like and I have to use a conditioner. I feel like you don't have to use a conditioner with this. Like my hair felt pretty clean and even soft after I washed it out. So maybe that has something to do with like the leave-in time, but I really like the way that this made my hair feel. And it's it's got sort of a more citrusy scent. It's def you can smell like the citrus in here, but I also can smell some of the other stuff. Like I definitely feel like I can smell cayenne, like maybe just a little bit. But there's so many different extracts and um, and plants in here. It's hard to sort of like pinpoint an exact smell, but it definitely has sort of like a citrusy, citrusy herbal. The conditioner is also really great. It's got a lot of the same great ingredients, um, in addition to some more moisturizing ingredients, because obviously conditioners need a little bit different of a formula than the shampoos do, but I also really like this one. And these both specifically say they're formulated for normal to oily hair and scalp conditions. Active herbal infusions, nutrient-dense rich plants, oils, and rich fatty acids create an advanced synergy delivering vital moisture to protect smooth soften and increase shine and restore manageability. This one you use just basically the same as any conditioner, but for longer hair like I have, um, to lead to focus on the mid shaft to ends, which I usually do. I, I will take a bit in my palm and rub my hands together and then sort of like distribute them from about here to here and then whatever's left I'll, I'll add up here a little bit. And sometimes that's where it gets, like because my scalp is as oily as it is, that's where it'll get like the greasiest is if I've got too moisturizing of a conditioner, it could make this up here look like I haven't washed my hair in days. So 
I do like that even though I ended up putting some up here, it didn't look like I hadn't showered, <laughs> basically. So I do really like this. It does also make my hair really soft and manageable. It's really easy to brush through once I'm ready to brush my hair. And this also has the same, it smells almost exactly the same as the shampoo, if not exactly the same. It's got like sort of a, a citrusy herbal scent. So I really like both of these. I feel like my hair felt really clean without feeling stripped, and I also feel like, I I don't know if you guys can tell, but I feel like there's a lot more body to my hair than there usually is. Like, I feel like it's, I feel like there's more of it, even though obviously I haven't grown more hair, but I feel like it's sort of like grabbed on. Maybe it's like, I just feel like there is more of my hair and that it's got more texture and volume, which, I mean, I'm always, I'm always constantly trying to make my hair, you know, like look, look better because it's so thin and thin and fine. But when I grab it, it doesn't feel, it doesn't feel like it's, it's, you know, as fine or as thin. So there's definitely something in here that's helping with the body of my hair. Not, maybe not necessarily volume, but body. So there's like more, more to my hair. So I really, I really like these. And I think that if you've got oily hair and even fine hair, I think that if you've got fine hair, you're really going to like these products because I do feel like they make a significant difference to just like the feel of my hair. And even second day, I didn't notice that much of an oil problem. Like sometimes when I'll wash my hair and the next day, my hair will look really greasy and I'll have to wash it. Some days, sometimes. But this one, my hair still looked really clean and it still felt really nice and it felt like kind of like bouncy and just like really, it just felt really nice. Sometimes it's really hard for me to sort of like describe exactly how I feel, but I think, I feel like you could probably even tell a difference just in like how my hair looks versus how it usually does. Cause usually it just like, it lays flat and it just hangs there, but I feel like it's got more, there's more to it. So in combination with these, like these are the only things that came in the Beauty Heroes box, but since I did know that these were coming, I did go ahead and I ordered the Josh Rosebrook Lift, which a lot of people have been raving about lately. And this again also creates hair talk texture and volume. So I have also used this in combination. And this says it's supposed to create weightless thickening volume and texture with a matte natural finish. And I also really like this as well. I think this benefits the shampoo and conditioner, those add volume and body, and I think this adds even more. So I really like all three of these products, and I think they work really well together. My hair doesn't feel sticky, it doesn't feel stiff, it doesn't feel like... It just feels really good. I hope that was articulate enough for you, but I would say that if you've been thinking about trying the Beauty Heroes box and you've got oily hair or you have fine hair or thin hair, this definitely would be a good box for you to try because, and especially if you've been wanting to try Josh Rosebrook, this is a really good opportunity because of the discount that you can get. Or even if you have already are a member or have been a member and you would get the $40 subscription price, this is definitely a really good value. And these are really great products. And Jeannie had told me that she worked with Josh specifically to pick these products as the hero products, even though I think there are others in the line that people do like a lot as well. These are the ones that she worked with him to pick as the hero products. So I really like these. I would recommend these to anybody. I think they would work great even for people with hair that's different from mine. I think that this would work well for a lot of different hair types. So I really like this. If you have been thinking about getting the box and you've maybe been putting it off, I would go for this one. I also wanted to let you know that my coupon code is still active until uh, November 20th. Everybody's coupon codes are going to expire, like from every, anybody that offers a coupon code, it's not gonna be valid in December because of the product that's in the December box. I don't think I'm allowed to tell you what it is yet. I did email Jeannie asking um, what I am and am not allowed to say about it because I did sort of figure out what the product was. She didn't tell me specifically, but I did figure it out. Um, but I did sort of wanna get you excited for the December box because I am so excited for the December box, you guys, you have no idea. The value of the December box is going to be at $185, which is why nobody's coupon codes are going to work in December because the value of the box, they have to sort of offset the cost of what they're paying for the product that's in there. So nobody's codes are going to be active. It's going to be $39 for everybody in December. So if you want to use the discount code and you want to get $10 off, I would su subscribe to this box so that way you can get the discount code. Um, you still are going to be end up paying $29 plus $39 for next month's box, but I think it's super worth it. So it just depends if you've been wanting to use the code. But next month, I'm so excited for everything that I've read about the product. Um, everybody raves about it. I don't think I've seen one negative review on it, and I am just so excited for it. So 
you're definitely going to want to be subscribed to the December box, trust me. I'm, I'm even thinking about like adding a second account, like gifting myself another box because I really want, I'm, I'm really excited about the December box, but, but that's everything that I have for today um, and this review. I hope that that was coherent and not too choppy. Um, but I really do like these products. I think they work fantastically. They make my hair feel really good. Let's see how it smells. Yeah, my hair still smells really good. It doesn't, it doesn't, the citrus scent doesn't really linger, which is nice if scent, if scent bothers you. It doesn't make my hair smell like perfume. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you subscribe to the service. Um, if you're not already subscribed, I hope you subscribe now and I will see you in my next video. Bye.